Hey everybody, we are starting episode four. Uh, the fam is all together, and we're gonna go help out the sheriff and uh, see what kind of trouble we can work into there. Let's get going. check out the base later I kind of just want to get into some action you know that's just who I is um, but let's go ahead and check it out oh that's cool cowboy Petey is the name of my vehicle and I love it I think it's great let's see leave Ranger headquarters uh, load into the car and head to the world map take the footpath to downtown Colorado Springs or don't leave. Hmm. Let's don't leave real quick. I need to check um, where I'm going. Let me check the journal real quick. In downtown Colorado Springs. Cool. So let's jump in. Leave Ranger headquarters. Take the footpath to downtown Colorado Springs. Here we go. All right. Big money, big money, no whammies. Citizen, everybody seems to be in distraught because all their homies are dead everywhere. Uh, let's Please, get this party started. my son's not a Dorsey. We ain't gonna fail. Let him go. We ain't <laughs> weak like you. Nice. Bastards! All right. Murderers! Magistrate. Dorsey, scum! This door man looks at, out at the pillories with an expression of grim satisfaction. His swallow skin pulls tight over his face and his thin lips press together in a hard line. Howdy, Judge. How's your heart? Still colder than a well digger's ass? Marshal Kwan. Impertinent as ever, I see. Rangers, I am Magistrate Silas Watkins. I have heard of your arrival. Partly from the confessions of the Dorsey Raiders, You'll be pleased to know that I sentenced them to death for their part in the attack on the city and your convoy. What's with the pillories? They are the only instrument of justice we need. Serious offenders die by exposure. Sometimes I might grant a reprieve after frostbiters claim their extremities. Death by exposure seems harsh. You have no other punishments here? Let's talk about something else. Goodbye. Indeed. Dorsey scum! Murderers! How does it feel now? <clears throat> Bastards! Dorsey! If it's... Ah, oh, marshals. Finally. I was beginning to think you were never going to help... Hold on now. You aren't marshals. You look like ruffians. <laughs> Are you here to see the sheriff? Well, I'm first. I've been waiting here on tenterhooks for an hour. Ruffians? Are you always this rude? What kind of help do you need from the marshals? I'm sorry. I was raised better than that. It's just... I am under considerable duress. My family has been kidnapped by those no-good Dorseys, and... And the Marshals will give me no answers about their situation. They won't even speak to me. I must know how the Sheriff intends to rescue them. And when. That may be, but my family is one of the leading families of Colorado Springs. We have been longtime allies of the Patriarch and supporters of all he stands for. Surely that should be given some consideration. I think so. Thank you, friends. One more voice urging her to action might be sufficient. Thank you. Sheriff Daisy, I will Dorsey, not leave stop. until you speak to you me. You should build some more watchtowers around the garden. Dorsey slipped right past the ones we've got. Yeah, but... 
the sheriff is a status status quo woman, maybe. I don't know that word. No, well, woman with graying blonde hair and steel in her smile. Well, now, you must be the rangers. I'm the sheriff around here, but you can call me Daisy. Old Saul tells me you're a bunch of badasses, and I ain't one to turn away a badass, especially at a time like this. I reckon you already heard all about the Dorsey raid, so I won't bore you with the details. Suffice it to say, we whooped them good, and the survivors are holed up in the Garden of the Gods with a bunch of hostages. Thing is, I lost a lot of marshals. My boys and girls are tired and beat up. You want to make some fast friends around here? You could go into the garden and speak to those Dorseys for us. Maybe find out how the hell they got into the city in the first place. And by speak, you mean shoot the everlasting shit out of them and save those hostages, right, boss? Quan, I hear you're some fancy liaison now. Old Saul taking my people without even asking? How dare he? Anyway, yes, you rascal. That's exactly what I mean. But question him first, you hear? Ma'am, yes, ma'am. Hmm. That girl? You think I ain't heard her yapping? But I got a couple of 50 other people yapping at me, too. Tell you what, though. Her people are hundred family folks from the fancy side of town, so they got some pull. You can do me a big favor and kill two birds with one stone if you take little Miss Wesson with you when you go to save them. In fact, I'm going to insist on it. I need that girl out of my hair. I'll let Lipinski know you're bringing her along. He won't let you into the garden without her. Don't worry. She knows which end of the gun the bullets come out of. Go in there All and right. kick some ass, Rangers. Well, if she dies, it's not on my conscience. You spoke to Sheriff Daisy like you promised, strangers. Thank you. I... I heard her tell you to take me with you to the Garden of the Gods. So, when do we leave? Hmm... She's making a joke. She knows very well that my father taught me to shoot almost before I could walk. And I'm the best shot in this city. You may ask anyone. Everybody knows what I can do. But have you ever killed anyone? We don't care how well you shoot. We're not taking a kid into Cambit. All right, then. Let's go. At last. <sighs> This is almost like True Grit a little bit. No right <laughs> bitches! Stop! No right bitches! Extra, extra! Cowardly attack on Colorado Springs! Don't turn it, Martha. Why else would I even keep a shotgun around if and I don't use it? Do so you know who the Garden of the Gods is just north of Market Square? Marshal Lupinski should be out front. The old man? A scrawny Ooh. old man with a shotgun. This here's Market Square. Oh, snap it, Jimmy Bob's still standing. Dorsey's or no Dorsey's? You think a little raid would stop snapping Jimmy Bob? No siree. Oh, hey. New faces? Let me know if you need to restock. I hear there's still some Dorsey's in the city. Let's trade. Let's. Oh, they got some Snickers and some attorney tarts. Buy some bits. Lamb. Here, uh, you can, uh, let's, uh, set junk there. Boom. Okay. That worked out great. What is this? Yellow snowball. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> the impact only lasts a moment, but the shame lasts a lifetime. <laughs> Throw at a target character to leave them wondering when their life turned wrong. 
10% chance to apply the stink, 5% chance to apply black thaw, 5% chance to apply Denver rot, 5% chance to apply freezer burn, 5% chance to apply ice pox, 5%, 5% chance to apply Rocky Mountain oyster. <laughs> All right. Uh, you got any ammo for me? Uh, how much money? I only have $93? Dang. Well, that's rough. I'm gonna close. Let's check this out. Continue. You can right click on any of your items to see extra actions you can do with them. For example, this is an easy way to quickly heal up your ragers after combat. To view your character stats, you can left click the derived stats button, the, de the derived stats button while in the inventory screen. These stats are primarily determined by your attributes, but certain skills, your equipment, and any active status effects will influence them as well. Any weapon can be broken down into spare parts by field stripping it. If you have very low barter skill, you can sometimes get a better price from merchants for the parts than the weapon itself. With the scrounger's touch perk, field stripping also has a chance to grant weapon wants. You've earned a perk point. Proceed to the perk screen to unlock powerful new perks. Okay. Rangers will, will earn one attribute per level. Attributes will will always cost one point to upgrade. Attributes are the source of all your vital stats. Want to live longer, run faster, shoot straighter, or hit harder, there's an attribute for that. Alright. Um, hmm. Strength is your office. Let's do that. So add a strength, get my health up a little bit. Perk. Ooh, learning perks. Starting at level four, your ranger will earn a perk point for every other level. Perk points are used to unlock powerful abilities and passive bonuses. Perks become available to learn as you upgrade your skill. Nice enough to light out for you. Find a soft spot. Easier for you to take them down. Some say they prefer quality over quantity, but those people usually reconsider their tactics when they're trying to outrun a downpour of lead. Tears up an enemy with twice as many SMG bullets as your normal attack, but has a minus 25% hit chance. Hmm. Then we have, after a few bumps and bruises, you stop feeling the pain so much. Crit resistance, evasion, con, healthy. Yeah, I think I'm going to start with that. Mm, and this one, I'm going to do maybe... Some armor. Oh, oh! Do I not have any more perk points? Oh, they do. She needs armor. Yes. Um, 
reduces an enemy evasion. Marked targets also take 50 plus damage from precision strikes. Yeah, I'll do that. I don't care about you guys. Okay. Skills. Oh man. Um, survival. Yep. Okay. Cool. Oh, chance. Okay. Um, let's give you a strength and a extra points, luck, and a hit chance. There we go. Alright. Cool. Glad we got to level up our characters a little bit. I gotta make sure that um, I don't uh, forget nothing like that. statue of what looks to be the patriarch and uh yeah jesus loaves and fishes christ that's a bomb under my stomach oh well i guess shit. that takes care of the landmine what does what does happen i'm back in business i didn't even okay well <laughs> That was terrible. <laughs> there was no warning for that at all. I'm just like, doo -doo 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 -doo. oh man, there's a bomb right there. As I'm straight up walking into it. Um, yeah, that's annoying. Oh, well. Mm. slinks around your ankles scratch under its chin try to rub its belly sorry kitty we have to go our own separate ways scratch underneath its chin oh yeah petting kitties that's what this game's all about you know that's all for now okay well let's go ahead and oh there's a club Ooh. unshaven and slovenly Marshal Lipinski shifts his unlit, half smoked cigar to the corner of his mouth as you approach. I heard we had some new arrivals wash on in. Military types, they said. Can't really see the difference between you and the ordinary class of mercs. Well, much as I'd love to shoot the shit with you tryhards, Sheriff Daisy said to let you go on in. So, go on. Give them Dorseys some hell. Marshal Lipinski? I expect you to moderate your language in the presence of a young lady. Jesus. My apologies, Miss West. I meant no disrespect. Best of luck to you and your companions here. <laughs> Goodbye. No room for amateurs in this town. You hear? No room.
Alright, one, two, three, four, five. Who's missing? Alright. It's a little hard to keep the party together. It's probably because I don't know what I'm doing, but, you know, hey. Let's get going. Are you sure you want to travel to the Garden of the Gods? Yes, I'm sure. The Blood Beast. Hmm. Interesting. Hello? Whoever just came up from the city, come in. This is Bellamy Ward. I... There are Dorseys all over the garden. I'm pinned down on a high ledge. Can... Can you reach me? Where are the rangers? Sit tight. We'll take care of the Dorseys. No promises, but we're planning to kill every Dorsey we find. Stop your bubbering. Just say out of the way and let us deal with the Dorseys. Right. I'll just keep my head down then. Hey! You on the ledge! Hands up! Oops. Oh no! They found me! Sorry, kitty. We have to go our separate ways. I don't want the cat to die. Let's go. What is this? Leafy. Warmed by solar collectors and other weird devices, the snow melts into droplets of water before it reaches them. That's really cool. That's how he's making all the food. I was curious about that. Staggered is the way to go. I believe on this. Oh, I might actually be able to get a shot off, huh? Out of range. In need of transfusion. And shoot you in the face, obviously. Uh, let's see this. Yeah. 
She nailed it. Yeah. Woo. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> All right. And then some grenade. Oh, yeah. And shoot at this guy. Nice. All right. Man, I really like the combat in this game. A lot of fun. The young gentleman is covered with dirt and shivering from the cold. His eyes are wide and shocked. Oh, oh God. Did the Patriarch send you? I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I, I need to warn you. The Dorseys are gathering up ahead between the gateway rocks. Bellamy! Bellamy, look at me! Have you seen my family? Are they here? Lucia? I, I thought you were with your family. Oh, thank God you're not. Thank God. They went up ahead with their hostages, but... Lucia, I heard gunfire and screaming. You need to be ready for the worst. If they've done anything to my people, I'm going to end them all. Her eyes brim with tears. She turns away angrily when she sees you looking. Please do. I'll tell whatever I can to help. It's not much, but... God, no, I was stalling for time. If I had a few hours and the right chemicals, though, I could have prepared quite a surprise for them. Oh, man. Maybe he can build some bombs for us. Where are the hostages? I think they took everyone to their camp, just past the Gateway Rocks. What about my family, Belle? Last I saw them, they were all right. They were scared and a little banged up, but they were still alive. All right. Saved my life. I won't forget it. Let's go check out this weapon crate, shall we? Bob. Can she patch him up? Or what? Thank you for the medical attention. There we go. Thank you for the medical attention. <laughs> All right. Uh... Hmm. Level six blunt weapon, huh? Check 
of the bodies. And yeah. Oh, oh. You know how it is. I'm taking everything, even moldy socks. If I can sell it, I want it. Alright, let's move up. Good. I could have repaired that, but uh, don't got the mechanics. Let's check out this booze box, though. Huh? Oh, there's a trap. Oh, no. My goodness. Upon being revived, your character will suffer a lasting injury. Injuries can only be removed with an injury kit item or by getting treatment from a doctor and PC. Each injury your downed ranger suffers from will decrease their stats and reduce the time you have to revive them if they are downed again. Oh my goodness. Alright, well, where's my healer at? <laughs> there she is. Nope. Together, we're unstoppable! <laughs> Hopefully that keeps you fixed up for a little bit. These mm. mines are going to be the death of me. Oh, man. That was awful.
Charge up this ability with each successful attack, target a specific area. guy's at one? He's about to bleed to death. All coming on really fast. Unlocked wolf vehicle upgrades. You've unlocked a vehicle upgrade. Return to Ranger HQ. Okay. Oh, I had a 5% chance of missing and I missed it. Hello. 
that worked out fantastically. <laughs> All right. And now what? Oh, man. Fifty-one percent. Come on, let's just finish this. You ready? No. <laughs> Elena's down. No. Ready? Okay. Well, that was a huge bummer. And uh, one that I don't appreciate. <laughs> Give some people some better weapons, shall we? Alright. Um let's equip that. Oh my goodness. Alrighty. Mm-hmm. And obviously she'll get the new sniper. Because I mean what what is even that, you know? Um, hmm. You survive all incapacitated squad members. Hmm. Glad we had those. <laughs> uh, use item itself. All right. Cool. Nice. More equipment. And these armors are interesting, huh? <laughs> I love like the the scarf and everything going on. Very cool. Very cool. Okay. And then apparently I need four strength for everything else. So... Okay, got everyone. Interface for the photon amplification lens looks simple. Most routines are automated, but there are some controls you can adjust. 
Press the button labeled the Just Photon Collection Amount. Activate Photon Application Lens. A happy flower appears on the screen. It says PAL activated. PAL. Oh, interesting. bodies it looks like. Ooh, an injury. Yep. Thank you. And Molotov cocktails. Nice. I am going to give that to Bob. Yep. Um Quip. Alrighty. Let's see, let's go, let's go. Isaac Reed. Uh-oh. Uh, I don't... What just... What just happened? <laughs> that was weird. <laughs> the clothes on this young man are impeccably tailored. The height of local fashion. He holds his hands up and launches into what is obviously a prepared speech. I'm Isaac Reed. On behalf of all of us here, I want to offer our unconditional surrender. As proof of our goodwill, I want to tell you that the culprits got into town with help from Farron Brigo's organization, and... and... Isaac, how could you? How could you throw in with these people? How could you let them take my family? Where are my parents and my little brother? They're... they're in the grave you passed on the way here. Oh, man. They didn't suffer, Lucia. I promise. Baby, look. I didn't mean it to go this way. I tried to stop them. I, I really did. I begged. Hmm. Stop talking right now. Wait a minute. You kids were helping the Dorseys? Just tell us how those people wound up dead. You piece of shit. You helped them kill Lucia's family, and you won't. You want our forgiveness? Not forgiveness. We want to face justice. We know what we did is wrong, but it was Melius Dorsey. He went looking for your family, Lucia. Your family, especially. That's why I got you out of your house before the raid. I didn't want anything to happen to you. You didn't want anything to happen to me? So you let savages abduct and murder my family. You knew what they meant to me. You knew what their loss would do to me. But you're still alive, Lucia. Don't you see? You're still alive, and that's what matters most to me. Where's Nihilus Dorsey now? What? Why did you do it, Isaac? Why betray your community? Were the Dorseys acting alone? Did they su have support from anyone else? Farron Brigo's gang helped them get into town. I don't know how or why. And I overheard Nelius say something about Liberty Buchanan, the Patriarch's daughter. I think... I think she's going to attack Colorado Springs. It sounded like she's gathering an army out in the plains. Something way worse than the Dorseys. Where's Nihilus he escaped. Dorsey now? He took some vehicles and headed west into the mountains. I don't think he was planning to come back. Why'd you do it, Isaac? Why betray your community? We've been under the Patriarch's boot for 50 years. We say that the hundred families are in charge. But it's really just his family. Just him. I know you must think I'm a fuzzy-headed idealist, but this society's sick. It needs to change. I have heard enough. If your betrayal of my family was not sufficient, your treachery here most certainly is. In the name of the Patriarch, I sentence you. Please, Lucia. Nice. I did this for you. All I ever meant was to help build a better world for you. For all of us. I can't tell you how much I regret. Please don't kill me. Please. Go for it, kid. He's garbage. Please, Lucia. I love you. <laughs> yeah. 
Amen, brother. <laughs> and then her hand does shake violently. She pulls the trigger anyway. The bullet strikes him in the gut. He topples, blood spilling from his lips and slowly spreading pool of gore surrounding him. He turns his head up to Lucia, ag agony in his gaze. It's going to take him a long time to die. Finish the job, kid. You wanted to take a life. Take it. Okay. All right. She breathes deeply, her eyes closed. When she opens them again, you see the steely gaze of a killer. Isaac does too. Please, Lucia. Please. She shoots him in the forehead. The back of her bowl skull splatters all across the snow. She turns away and is violently sick. Behind her, Isaac breathes his last. You psychos! You killed Isaac! You'll kill us all! Oh, <laughs> all right then. I need some help. Please. Oh, This uh, song, it's fantastic. I like the remix. You're all dead. Come in November 1. This is Ranger HQ. We're getting reports of shooting in your last known location at Garden of the Gods. What's your status? Over. We took care of the Dorseys. There are no survivors. We killed every last Dorsey rat and the Hunter family's kids helping them. Roger that, November 1. Maybe let's not talk too loudly about this killing Hunter family's kids business. Over and out. <laughs> well, let's grab up their loot. Ho oh, ho. Got some brass knuckles, some Colorado dollars. Oh, a bunch of rich kids got money for me. <laughs> nice. Gather up my loot. To install a weapon or armor mod, select the weapon or armor you want to upgrade and choose the modify option under it. Different mods require different armor or weaponing modding skills. The better the mod, the harder it is to install. Alrighty. Well, that was an awesome mission. Um, well, Bill and Bob and, and the fam get through it, barely. Uh, hopefully I can uh, stop from stepping on mines in the future. And uh, if you like this video, please hit that like button. If not, hit that dislike button. And uh, please subscribe. Have a wonderful day.